right, survivors, welcome back to the long dark. Let us pick up where we left off with the winter mute story mode. We had ended the last episode on our way back to uh, Granny's house after checking out a tunnel for her, right? That had collapsed. There was a bus there, prison bus. And we were heading back through Milton and there was a wolf coming down the road. We ducked into a house to hide from it. So let's, uh, let's pick up right there. Here we go. And here we are in the house that we ducked into to avoid the wolf outside coming up the street. Uh, oh, let's grab that. So I'm wondering if the wolf has left. I don't think so. I think um, they stay right where they are when you enter homes and other buildings and so forth. Um, well, I guess there's only one way to find out. Now, if I crouch here and go outside, will I be crouched when I get out? Let's find out. Come on, game. Do me a solid. I'm crouched, and I hear something. Well, oh, there it is. Yep, there's the wolf. He just came, he was in that house. He just came out of that house. Okay, let's go around back. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I think I saw a second wolf on the road eating a carcass that wasn't there. Oh, hi. We'll go this way then. Make up your mind, front or back. Yeah, that deer carcass was gone yesterday. I think anyway. Ran down the street and I had mentioned it. That it was missing. And yes indeed, there's a wolf there eating a deer carcass. Must have killed another one. Oh, hi! Dude, you don't know what you want! I don't think he sees us or he just doesn't care right now. Alright, heading back the other way toward the wolf eating the deer. Maybe they'll fight over it. That'd be pretty awesome. So I think what we'll do is just go around the back side. And, and, and while we're over here, we can uh, check out that house. Oops, stick. That we dropped a bunch of stuff off in. And grab that before we get back to Granny's and have everything together. Let's open up that hood because I'm pretty sure we checked both of these, right? Yeah, fairly certain we did. Um, that'll give us an indication that we've been there. Yeah, there's the wolf eh? eating. Enjoy your meal. Okay, this is the house where we put a bunch of stuff in the first cabinet, right? Search cabinet search. Yes, here it is. Oh, not very much, though. Thought I put more than that. Jerry can is really what, what I want mostly. Now that we have a lantern... We're going to need that fuel. All right, let's head back out. One wolf is still there eating. I don't see the other one. All right, let's hustle up to Granny's. Can I run? Yeah, barely. Weighted down. Yeah, whew. That is tiring. How are we doing with sunshine? Oh, we got plenty of daylight left. Let's put the gun away. The gun away, Will, before we head inside. Oh, nope. Put that down, too. Thank you. Uh, just, just drop it. There we go. Okay, inside we go. Did you find it? It was there, like you said. And your friend? No sign of her. The tunnel's blocked. Looks like maybe an avalanche. But I think she got through before that happened. Oh. If the tunnel is blocked... That's the end for Grey Mother. So the tunnel is the only way through the mountains? No. Not the only way through. But my only way through. Grey Mother is tired now. Let her rest for a while. Aw. That's so sad. So the only way Granny can leave Milton, or this this area anyway, is through the tunnel, which is now collapsed. Um, yeah, that's really sad. Now, hang on a sec. I'm missing some locations on this map. There were like dead deer. It said Grey Mother on them. And now they're gone. What's up with that? Yeah, I don't know what those are for. Some kind of lo uh, points of interest, I suppose. Oh, by the way, I missed the soup that Granny made. <laughs> it's right here. 
Oh, Granny, I, I ate the wrong soup, apparently. This is the hot cup of, of soup that she made. So, I guess we'll just save that for later. I don't really need it. I'm not cold or anything. Well, let's just drink it now. Should come in handy. Yeah, well, I guess I can take it. And, yeah, let's drink it. Let's drink it right now because we're kind of thirsty. Is that food or drink? It's a little bit of both, actually. Oh, yeah. That was great. Did it hydrate at all? Hmm, not really. Okay, here's what we're going to do. I am going to drop a bunch of stuff that I don't need and get reorganized and maybe do some repair work. Let's check the clothes and see how the clothes are looking right now, the stuff we're wearing. Let me fix up this toque, for example. Let's repair that. Put the sewing kit. There we go. Beautiful. 100%. All right, guys. Still getting organized and doing some repair jobs here on Will's clothes. And I'd really like to fix up these boots, but I need cured leather. So I'm, I'm thinking I can tear these down, right? We don't need the, the uh, sneakers for anything. So let's harvest. Yes, two cured leather. Nice, but it's going to take an hour and 15 minutes. If I don't rest I'm going to faint. Yeah, hold on, Will. We're going to fix up your booties. Let's have a drink of water. So we don't die of dehydration while we're harvesting the leather. All right, there we go. Hour and 15 minutes. Hopefully we can stay awake for this. All right, there we go. And now we repair, which is a 95% chance of success. Make sure you use that sewing kit. Bam! Did it! Awesome! 100%! Like new. Check them out, Granny. They're like new. I can't be oh. here anymore. My friend is out there and she needs my help. Please, tell me how to find her, and I'll do whatever I can to help you get out of here. There's only one thing left to be done. You need to put her to rest. Put her to... I'm not giving up yet. On the other side of town, there's a farmhouse. You'll find a key to a safety deposit box somewhere in there. Go to the bank. And bring me the box that matches the key. Then you'll understand what happened to her. Wait, farm? Bank? What's this have to do with my friend? They left her, didn't they? She needed help, and they let her go. This is how we make it right. I don't understand. In the bank, you'll find the answers. Now go. Man, Granny is P.O.'d. Somebody was helping Astrid. At least I think we're talking about Astrid here. I don't know. Lots more questions, lots of mysteries. But man, is she mad. All right, yeah. Uh, triggered. Triggered Granny here. How about... Who's sick? What are you talking about? You seem distracted. Tired. Are you okay, Granny? I'm old. Sometimes the mind wanders, outsider. Travels to other places, other times. I think about her, cold and alone. Are you talking about my friend? They should have helped her. I don't think she's talking about Astrid, to be honest. Her, her mind is wandering. Maybe this is, uh, like a child of hers or another friend. I don't know. Let's ask about the bus. Tell me about the bus, Granny. She was there at the bus. I'm sure of it. You have a sense of her passing there? I think she left a sign for me. A word, perseverance. Right, that was written in the bus, right? A world from the old days. Why would she write that? I think that's supposed to be word. I don't know. Maybe she wanted me to know she wouldn't give up? Or reminding you not to? It has to mean something more. Why? Because you matter so much to her? No, because she wrote it in her own blood. Hmm. There is a town, far to the north. Perseverance Mills. Maybe she was showing you the way. Perseverance Mills. How do I get there? There is no way now. By car, perhaps. On foot? No path that Grey Mother knows. Great. All right, well, that's good to know. So there's a place called Perseverance, and I'm thinking Astrid wrote that. You mentioned a farm? 
Yes, on the other side of town, the old Barker farm. Barker? Yes, a liar and a thief, mostly. Right. You'll say... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe that guy's still alive? The bank. Tell me about the bank. Bah! Bank from the mainland. Never belonged here. Usually banks are pretty secure. Not sure I'll be able to get in. The branch closed years ago. The collapse took everything. What do you do about money? Some of us still use the old paper. Or barter. I haven't seen paper money in years. What a value could possibly be left in the bank? You ask questions when you should be finding answers. Now get me the safety deposit box. Then everything will become clear to you. Yes, it will. I've been to the bank already, actually. Now we're done here. I'll see what I can find, Granny. Alright. So, oh, there is a chair here. That, where did that chair come from? Oh, and she brought more soup. I got a chair and more soup. Oh, she's lovely. And I got my dead rabbit, my little pet bunny down there. Hey, bunny. Nice. Okay. Uh, that's swell. Now, we should probably go to sleep now. We got a good eight hours of sleep tonight, Granny. Um, do we need to eat or drink or anything? Nah, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Let's get upstairs and get to bed. Um, might have to light a match for this. No, there's just enough light to find my way down the hall to my, to the guest room. Although I'm going to end up in the closet. Nope, there it is. Okay. Awesome. All right. How many cal calories is this going to consume? Eight hours. We're going to need eight hours, I'm thinking. All right, yeah, good night. See you in the morning. I hope I can get through with that food there. Ooh, it's going to be tight. All right, good night. See you in the morning. I'll die if I don't drink something soon. Oh, gosh. Yep, just woke up. Eight hours of sleep. Super thirsty. Let's have some of that lovely Canadian lemonade. Mmm. Okay, and guess what? It's still night and very dark. Uh, and the night is full of terrors. So how about if we... Um, Sleep for another two hours. Three hours? Three hours should bring us right into the early morning with some sunshine, hopefully. I'm not even sure if I was able to sleep for three hours. Look at that. Oh, my eye my eye is still a little tired, so I guess I did sleep all night. That's nice. But I can't see a darn thing. Let's get a match out here. And, oh, belly. My belly is grumbling. Oh, nice ceiling. Okay, let's go see Granny, and I think I guess we'll head out. We have a lot of mysteries and clues, and hey, you took my chair and you drank my soup, Granny. <laughs> you couldn't help yourself. That's fine. It would have gotten cold, so I get it. I get it. I would have done the same. All right. Well, how much water do we have for this little trip? We don't have much, but hopefully that's enough. Um, well, why don't we take a look at the map here, and let's go over this with Granny. Just so we're on the same page. So we need to search the Milton farmhouse for a safety deposit key. Then bring it back to town and open up the safety deposit box in the bank. And then bring its contents to Granny. And then all shall be revealed. I suppose. And can you bring that map back up? Whoop, 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 whoop. And it looks like... Okay, that's the bank. We know that. What is that there? She's sending us down the street to check something out in the house. Because this looks like the farm. Paradise Meadows Farm. I don't know what this is. Granny, what is this down the road? It's not on here, unless that's like a side quest. Eh. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Alright, still looks really dark out there. I'm just gonna take a quick peek outside. Granny, I'll be right back. Okay. How's the weather? It's, uh, it's not too cold. Of course, we do have a little wind protection here on this lovely porch. But I can't see very far. I don't think I want to travel in that dark. Let's give it a few minutes. So I suppose while we're here, do we have any more repair work we can do? How about these uh, pajamas? Yeah, let's repair these. 25 minutes. Maybe we'll use up one of these sewing kits. And I don't have to carry it around anymore. Awesome. That was easy peasy. Okay, I think we're good now. So, Granny, you wait here. We'll be right back. 
with that safe deposit box. And hopefully she can answer some questions for us. Because I've got many burning questions that need answers. I'm not sure if this person she's talking about is actually Astrid. But it seems like she's super upset that some people didn't help this person that, he, that she's referring to. But we have to assume it's Astrid. And that Astrid wrote down Perseverance in that bus. Meaning, uh, maybe meet her Perseverance. So, we got some clues. We just gotta, uh, we just gotta get there. Uh, I see some rose. Oh, can I get up this hill? Ugh. Another carcass over here? Pressing the E key, but that doesn't work. Uh, yeah, keep that thing locked and loaded, bro. I don't know where these wolves are. Grab these mushrooms from Granny. She loves them. And we don't need any more sticks. Okay. Let's stay on on target here. Oh, I see a house from here. That must be the place. Not much of a road left here, huh? Covered in snow. Nobody's plowing these days. Whoa. What were that? Thought I heard something crunching. Oh, I love that you get wind protection inside these, like, little ravines like that. That's pretty cool. Got an old wooden bridge over a frozen solid river. See anything down there? No. Okay, that must be the place. We are on the right path here, yes. Right over the bridge to uh, Grandma... No, Grandmother's house is the other way. So I guess if we go in this way... Ne whatever. <laughs> Okay, look at this, a silo, some bales of hay, and we got, what? Oh, that was scary. Uh, we got some old, old barns here, kind of messed up. Here comes the music. I don't like being on the side of this barbed wire. Because I can't jump it. Should have gone on the other side. Oh, there's the wolfie. Hey, wolfie. Oh man, wind is kicking up. It's getting cold. Let's get inside this house. Where's that wolf? Way over there. What is this? Nothing. Um. Oh, this house? That's not the house. That's a barn. Got the house over there. Oh, there it is. Paradise Meadows Farm. There's a truck over there. Bunny wabbits! Good. I think we'll try to get some bunny wabbits today. We'll get some meats. We we'll use some meat. Do I have a rock? I have a rock, but I'm not even gonna bother with you right now. You stay right there, bunny. I'll be back in a minute. Oh, a bench to sit on, a table to destroy. All right, well let's get inside. Oh no! Door is locked. Maybe the keys are around here somewhere. That's what I was just looking for. Seriously, I was looking for something hidden. Not under the mat, huh? That would be too easy, I suppose. Um, I wonder if it's in one of the barns or something. Dang it. It's freezing out here. I know it is, Will. We gotta hustle, buddy. I'm working on it. What's this? Work gloves. Some wood. Cedar. Um, it would be too obvious to have the keys out here in the back like that, wouldn't it? Shucks. I'm looking for a hidden cache. Oh, Will, this is bad. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get the picture. I get it. I get it. Let's go to the uh, this barn over here. Maybe. Oh, maybe the key's in the... What's that? There's a box. Temperature's dropping fast out here. Cold, cold day. No, it's just a crate. Dang it. Let's check the truck, I suppose. Get in. Truck Wait. seems to be dead. Get out of this. Engine won't even turn. <gasps> there it is. Paradise Meadows farm key. Dude, you're in the wrong seat. How did you know the car doesn't work? Oh, Will's good. He just looks at a car and knows it's not going to start. But we got the key. That's good. All right, no wolf out there. This is usually when they attack. All right, nothing in the back seat. Yeah, obviously we can't take a car. I don't think cars work in this game, do they? It would be pretty awesome if they did. We can hop in a car and just get the heck out of Dodge. Never come back. I guess that wouldn't be very fun. 
All right, we got the key, baby. We're going in. I'll log it. Into the farmhouse we go.